Hello! Today we're doing a Twisted 1.20 trailer breakdown. This is a ripoff of someone else's. We're not going to talk about that though. Um, I haven't watched it, but I'll link that one in the description. So, I got four arms right here. So, let's get into it. This is May 12th, 2023, uh, date. We Weed Trimmer and a couple of his friends intercepted a, a strong EF-1 with, with winds 149 miles an hour, I believe. And it was like beautiful. Got right in the center of it. That transition though, like the transition, you can't tell a difference. This, you don't even tell that it goes. They added a debris cloud. Let's go here. Refurbished, they, Wilza, a uh, builder of the thing, 20 hours ago. Twisted beta version 1.20 change long. The end of an era. The beginning of so much more. more. So much more. Twisted 1.20 is here and it's changed everything. Complete map rebuild. Refurb they, re they have refurbished or rebuilt every structure in game. Discontinued several old structures. Created 39 new structures. Repopulated the entire map from scratch with the new or refurbished structures. New power poles. New traffic lights and assemblies. New and improved road signs with over a hundred different variants. Significant terrain buff, more natural hills, trees, and areas of brush rebuilt trees, rebuilt trees, added more vari variations including birch. Fixed scale objects are now proportionally to reality. Improved lighting mechanics and structures and exterior lighting fixtures. Adding basements to several house models. Let's go, bro. That's like... Mwah. Basements are the best. Added new public shelter model. Extensive road improvements and bug fixes. Added several new roads, including a major route. County Road 61. Widened State Route 2 to 4 lanes for its entirety. Adjusted city populations to more realistic numbers. Bro, my friend knew. It was like, hey, you gotta do this, bro. Added unique stores and shops, advertisements, signs, etc. Added residential private docks on area lakes. Increased the size of Hazleton considerably. Let's go. Improved Hazleton Hills subdiv subdivision. That's good. Increased size of Viroqua considerably. Yeah. Viroqua is now the county seat of Cherokee County. Increased size of Hibbing considerably. Add a new city of Prior Lake. Population 3,752. Well, Welchel, Welchel Valley, retur Valley returns. I don't know what that is. Added village of Almora. Added village of Jemo. Added village of Wabon. They removed Welchenville, Waukesha, and Winaska. Welchenville and Waukesha, those are like my favorite cities. So that's... God, I hate that, bro. That's not nice. But in Winaska, I inter that was the first time I intercepted a tornado with winds above 200. If I can find it because it was like a while ago um damn I have like no clue where it is um here it is two months ago it 
it spiked and it did not want to stop spiking. I was like, oh yeah, I'm I'm fine. But it kept rising. I didn't I never got in the funnel. My probes never got in the funnel. And they got 215 miles an hour. Here we go. 200. Gunther is lifted in slow motion. 215 max. It was 1.16 miles wide at its widest point. But that was right at the Wanaska area. Moved airport to Hibbing. That's actually pretty good. Made Helma a true ghost town. <laughs> Added KSWB news station in Hazelton Hills. Thermodynamics. Added photographs. Adjusted max cape to 6,500. Made, made higher cape more rare. Added three cape and p, p watt thermo, thermodynamic variables. Added VTP and STP as composite indexes. Added 750 MB relative humidity. Added Zero to three kilometer and thirty six kilometer lapse rates. I don't know what any of those is except Cape. Added a SRH SRH. I don't know what that is. Storm motion change to follow wind profile. Okay, that's that's good. Can they move west yet? Storms and tornadoes. Complete storms and tornado rework. Goodbye stagnant stagnant meshes. New dynamic storm system. Realistic tornado wind field logic. That one's good. Reworked lighting and flickering and beating. Reworked storm structure. Added RFD cuts, shelf clouds, and more. Added dynamic RFD winds and straight line winds. New client new client F effects. See visual effects below. Visual effects. Added wind visual effects. Uh, I think I know now. I don't know too much, though. Tree swing, traffic light swing. Oh, that's what they meant. Added new rain and hail effects. Yeah, those those ones are good. Like, I've seen... I'll show, I'll show you by the trailer. Now, different levels of rain and hail intensity. Added new power flashes, which, they're just so good. I, I'm going to have to show you. Or like hail and hail bouncing. Damage. Added six new NWS damage indicators. Ma'am... MIM, ACT, MHDW, SSC, IB, and WHB. Added three new custom damage indicators SLO, SGB, CPIS. Added, added several new damage contextuals. New damage anchoring mechanism nails, bolts, washers, rebar, etc. Now, new debarking mechanics and different stages of partial debarking. Extensive optimization to damage physics. Added ability for some structures to roll or be thrown, mobile homes. Added new dam ability to f for unanchored structures to slide off foundations. New car damage physics, dragging, rolling, lofting. Oh, actually, that one's, like, really good. Wow, that one's actually... I really want that one. New player damage physics. Dragging, lofting. Yeah, those... I don't care about that one. Completely reworked radar. Radar is now pixelated and reprints, represents true accurate values. Added base velocity. Added two radar sites. Uh, KHZL NWS Hazleton. And THIB. T-H-I-B. Hibbing Airport. Added noises and less accurate... Values farther from radar sets, sites. Dead zones. I hate that one. Helicity added that one too. So what if it's realistic? I don't want it. So fucking stupid, bruh. Added ability to switch between radar sites. Added, added landscaping background to radar. Fixed issues with incorrect slash outdated route markers. Pressing I or O will now zoom in or out on radar. Trackpad support. New NWS basement. Added public shelters and conference room to NWS basement. Okay. NWS info board now works. What? 
increased polygon sizes. So now we can't be able to tell how wide a tornado is. Okay, thanks. Fixed EAS warning bug slash warning bugs. New information slash track panel. Vehicles. Added new Dominator 3 model. Added new Dow model. Added new TIV 2 model. Added new TIV 1 model. Added new Charger model. Added new Civic model. Honda is now Otabi for copyright reasons. Added new dynamic fuel system. Different gas stations now have randomized and different prices. Do you have to pay for it now, bro? I swear, if you have to pay for it, I'm going to kill somebody. Wilza or Serum? Or Serum, I don't know his name. Um, added different fuel gauge. Regular premium diesel. Vehicles now require specific fuel. I, oh wait, I don't have to pay. I have infinite fuel. Never mind. <laughs> I, I dot E can't put diesel in a Civic. Premium fuel performs better than regular. Chassis improvements. Chassis rebuild coming in 1.21. 1.21. Improved braking mechanics. Reworked car spawning. That's good. Probes. Probes now display health. Probes now show in truck beds. Ooh, that, that one's good. Added toggle for head turning, first person character viewing, uh, added notification if infinite fuel is disabled, infinite fuel automatically enables if bought in game. Name tags and chat bubbles will now go away if in cinematic mode. Yes! Oh my god, you don't know how... Oh, let's go. Clicking player names on player list now opens a menu okay that's kind of that's that one's good lobby and twisted light what added lobby system where you can join friends or specific servers option in lobby to select light game mode added twisted light more optimized for low-end devices data transfers between both games Miscellaneous new dynamic time system. Sunrise and set is now more accurately to reality in Minnesota, June. Okay, let me tell you something. Most of the cities are based out of Minnesota. Like Hibbing, this is in Minnesota, right around here. So is Wadena. Wadena is also in Minnesota. And actually, Wadena, they got hit by a big tornado. And it was on um, Storm Chasers. I think it was like 2011, around there. Got I think it was like 1.1 miles wide. We could probably view it somewhere here. It was an EF4, I believe. This is, I'm gonna, here it is. 1936 year. We go to here. One point one oh miles. So, pretty large tornado. Anyways. Made flashlights brighter. Reworked town beacon slash spawn system. Yeah, you can't really see it. Well, you can't really spawn some. Um, buffed darkness at bright. Twisted 1.20 releasing Sunday, July 23rd, 2023. Time TBT. To be deter determined. Okay. So... It will be out tomorrow. Uh, I don't know. Like, Olympian. I'll do like eleven. But yeah, now we get back to here. We can actually go to here. 
So this, that one's, that's this, this is the new uh, Dominator 3 model. It looks so much, that looks so good. That looks so much better. Wow, that one looks better. Here it goes. Here we go! The flooring. Stupid uh, people going in front. They even added that. <laughs> I'm mesmerized right now. I'll add the twi uh, read Timmer's video in the description, as well as this video and the other one. The other person's video. Twisted. Twisted. Present day key soda. Yep, there's the probe in the back. Dorothy 5. I think that's what it's called. With uh, the truck from Twister. Yeah, the movie. Wow, that one's actually. That, it looks so much better. Wow. Meadow Klein. Where's P-Stop? Where's P-Stop, bro? National Weather Service, it has a Doppler with stairs that go up to it. It's got this. It's got KSWB TV. This is the Hazelton one. There's the radio tower. Wadena State Park. I I can't remember if that was already in the game or they upgraded it. Because I feel like I've heard about it somewhere. That wasn't here. Prior Lake, New City. It looks so good. Oh, we need to zoom in, but I don't know. I don't I can't zoom in. That's those houses are so much better, bro. Look at the cloud structure. Oh God, this is velocity. It's now pixelated, which it's pretty bad. I don't the really National like the pixelated. They need to add correlation coefficient as well, but being able to Delta switch between. Yeah, tornado. do you see the rain now? Do you see, the, see how good that rain is? This is new, this is prior lake. Prior lake. Take cover now. Move to an interior room on the lowest yeah, floor in there. of a sturdy building. I think they have a basement. In a mobile home. Yeah, look at the rain. Or in a vehicle. Move to the wow, I the love that rain. And protect yourself from flying debris. They're coming in here. Get in, get in! Nice old tornado right there. I don't really like the mezzo structure. I like the old mezzos. The mezzo cyclones. I like the other one. That's the new um, do Dow or Doppler on wheels. That one just looks so much better because it's realistic. I'm going to get some uh, screenshots of the twisted vehicles. Come on, come on, kind of video. They're driving into a tornado. Ooh, look at the, look at the power lines. Oh, that one's about to hit that house. Look at, look at that. Oh, hi, Anna. got an animation for opening it now. J Kill in 03. What the hell? Why don't I get my own thing? 
That YouTuber got their own thing in, on the thing. Oh, there that goes. Wow. Tornado's coming for Hazleton. This is a uh, Hazleton. Look at these buildings. That that just looks so much cooler. Wow, look at the realistic hills though. That's cool. Why are you in the lobby? Why why are you standing in the lobby? Oh wow, look at the rolling stru look at the rolling things. The car rolling. Physics. That wow. And now that the tornado has gone through, you can see there's vehicles on their side. Notice how the only one is a Ford. You got the roof ripped off. Uh, things done. That's, that's like gone. Hey, Zilton. There's their little hole in the basement. That's the little basement. But that's cool right there. They're just like, I lost everything. No. Oh. You still got your slabbed house. <laughs> Look at that basement. And it releases July 23rd. So, comment if you found this helpful. And I'll see you in the next video.